Autism memes about Autism Speaks. I mean, nothing could go wrong there, right? Well, hello indie people, and today it's all about Autism Memes about Autism Speaks, which is a US-based company which has a bit of a bad reputation. But I wanted to show off some memes, talk about my own feelings about Autism Speaks, and just highlight some of the issues that people have with this organisation. First meme. It's all to do with giving to charities, this one. Now, I don't know what cartoon this is actually from. If you could let me know, that'd be great, because I mean... We've all got a lot of free time these days. But anyway, this one I think is quite funny because it just kind of highlights the kind of attitude I feel a lot of us in the autistic community have with Autism Speaks. Basically, when it comes to donating to autistic charities, a lot of people go for the larger organisations such as Autism Speaks. Though with Autism Speaks specifically, it's mainly research based. Wherever they get their funding from, it goes primarily into the research of autism rather than actually helping autistic people. And to be honest, that's not really ideal, you know. There's a lot of autistic people in the here and now that obviously need help and we need to help them as much as we can. Obviously, I think research is important, but I don't think it should be as big of a priority as it is in regards to Autism Speaks. So this one, though a bit direct, I kind of like it because it kind of just is that thing that I really dislike of these big organizations and you know they're putting the money into a place which I don't think necessarily helps the people. With this meme I'm gonna rate it 8 out of 10. I quite like it. It just says exactly what it says on the tin to be honest. Can't go wrong with it really. Next meme. I'm going to, oh god oh. There we go. <laughs> Next meme is to do with lighting it up blue, which is Autism Speaks main campaign in April, which when I'm uploading this, it's April 2020. In previous years, Autism Speaks has taken the courtesy of lighting historical landmarks blue, such as the Eiffel Tower. That's the most recent one I can remember, but there's probably other places that have lit it up blue in the name of autism awareness and all of that jazzy stuff. Lighting up buildings blue does such great work for helping the people. <sighs> I think the other reason why autistic people just aren't really fond of lighting it up blue as well is because it's about autism awareness, which I did make a whole video on autism awareness versus autism acceptance. I'll link that down below. But autism awareness is kind of insufficient for some autistic people because it's about understanding autism as a condition rather than accepting autistic people and the actual people who are living with autism. So for this meme I'm gonna give it a 6 out of 10 I think because it's quite funny but it's not as funny as the one before it in my own personal opinion. <laughs> do, 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 do. Next meme. Yeah. This one I found on Reddit pretty funny. Just It is just a juicy meme. But to be honest it got me thinking about autism charities in general and you know if a charity does something bad or you know obscene and it got me thinking about autism speaks like yes they've done a lot of bad things in the past such as you know looking at cures and you know research into autism and all of that stuff and not actually helping autistic people and also recommending ABA which is a whole different subject on its own. But to be honest, looking into the history of Autism Speaks and looking at other people who have also talked about the history of Autism Speaks, it is pretty shady some of the stuff when it comes to Autism Speaks. So it's no wonder that some people have this opinion of the company, sadly. And yes, I think companies are allowed to try and build a reputation back up again, but I think also it's kind of hard to do that when you have such negativity from the people that you're trying to help really. For me, I'm going to give this meme a 9 out of 10. It was just really funny when I saw it and found it on Reddit and that is what I'm going to go with. Booyah! But just to say, if you're enjoying the content so far, there's a link down below to a playlist full of these kinds of videos. And also, if you want to subscribe, it'd be greatly appreciated. But anyway, the next meme is all to do with Autism Awareness Day, which is on the 2nd of April. Now it's obviously passed, but Autism Awareness Day is 
One of those things that has confused me in the past quite a lot as an autistic person and when it comes to Autism Awareness Day it is something that Autism Speaks heavily pushes and to me I think Autism Awareness does have its stereotypes, it does have its stigmas around it which I can fully understand and I get. So to me I think highlighting autism at a particular time of year or just any time of the year quite frankly to you know give people the knowledge and understanding of what autism is for autistic people I think is a good thing. However autism awareness I think should really become autism acceptance over time. Now to rate this meme I'm gonna give it an 8 out of 10. Two points purely because of the cat, because I love cat. But yeah, it just raises a conversation for me personally. And yeah, it's just funny. That woman's face is just really funny. And it's just really... Now, the next meme is all to do with Autism Speaks speaking on behalf of autistic people. Now, this is quite a common thing within the community who, you know, is very much anti Autism Speaks. Autism Speaks doesn't speak for me. That kind of rhetoric. Now, when it comes to major charities, autism led charities such as Autism Speaks, they really do pave the way in terms of what happens, you know, on the ground as well as higher up. And to be perfectly honest, if it's not led by autistic people or has influence from the autistic community, you know, people who are autistic, then it's kind of meaningless. You know, I think it's always good getting, you know, an insight into what's actually impacting autistic people on the ground in the here and now, you know, and actually utilizing what people are saying to actually come up with a reasonable strategy of how to progress forward. But when it comes to parent led, mainly parent led organizations such as Autism Speaks, which to my understanding doesn't have anyone who is autistic on their board of directors, which it's just stupid to me. So to me, when it comes to charities, you know, relating to autism or governments looking into autism related bills, I think it really needs to come from autistic people or at least given autistic people the chance to actually say what they think on what you're trying to do. That's just how I personally think anyway. So for this meme and rating it, I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. Though it's not funny, I think it does raise a talking point, you know, and for people to look into Autism Speaks for themselves. If you want to see more autism memes, check out that playlist right there. But if you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a big thumbs up for me down below. Stay you, stay indie. I hope you have a great day and hope to see you next time.